Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Just Pat. I hope you guys are enjoying this yellow tint. But, guys, it's the end of 2016. Today is uh, December 31st. Oh, no, no, come on. Today, this year wasn't that bad. It wasn't terrible. I know people saying that 2016 was the worst year out of all the years, but every year we do this. Every year we look back and we're like, wow, there's been a lot of bad stuff that happened. Now, there has been a lot of bad stuff. But I think there's also been a lot of good stuff. I'm gonna go over my top five of things I've thought about this year that have been mm, not so good. The first one I gotta talk about for you guys is Harambe. Now, if you don't know who Harambe is, if you've been living under a rock for the last year, Harambe is a silverback, was a silverback gorilla living in the Cincinnati Zoo when a child fell into the enclosure and got hurt and then the gorilla started dragging the kid around and people were like looking at this video and blah, 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 blah. the zoo ended up shooting and killing the gorilla and animal activists and social media and people around the world were looking at this video and saying, why would you kill this gorilla? And obviously to protect the child's safety and nobody knows what, ha what happened if you shot it with a dart. So the crazy thing about Harambe that we all think about now is that he actually rose from the dead months later, lived in memes. He died for our memes, guys. Um, he was in so many memes, Twitter, um, Tumblr, social media in general was, had so many memes about Harambe, and it was the best months of my life. It was great, and I think Harambe is now dead again, just like the dab, but it is great, and great, great. It was great months, I loved it. Next, the next thing I gotta talk about is death. I know there's been a lot of deaths this year every time, Somebody dies, it's terrible, David Bowie, uh, Snape. Carrie Fisher is very recent in everybody's minds and it sucks. Not just that, but like ISIS and just like shootings. The Orlando shooting happened this year um, where a man uh, went into a gay nightclub in Orlando and shot it all up and killing many people. And just so many ISIS stuff and so much like, and not to just go on about ISIS, but there's been so much like the German bombings and just killings and Gosh, a lot of stuff happened this year about that. Sorry, hair check. I wanted to do more than five, but I think those are the biggest ones that I thought of. And I'm just gonna talk about some things that I thought were actually pretty cool this year. I'm a really big, I really like video games and I like tech. And one thing that I'm really happy and really stoked for in the next years is VR. Uh, the HTC Vibe and like um, PlayStation VR and Oculus Rift. I know Oculus Rift has been um, like, Oculus Rift has been out there for a long time, but there's more VR now. There's not just the Oculus Rift and like third party things, um, but there's actually some kind of like VR now and it's really awesome to see. I asked my Facebook friends what they thought about 2016 and I asked them to do one comment. A few people trolled, said, I commented on the status, um, I love you. There are some very good ones and I really didn't like specify, I just said comment one thing that um, meant to, meant a lot to you. Some people went on adventures to places. My one friend went to South America to do a, um, like a study abroad and she really loved that and she got so many adventures out of that. And that's really cool. Uh, some people learned, uh, learned about how to trust themselves or patience. I for one have learned to pat be patient more with myself as well. Um, and just like learn about and like trust, trust the process, I guess. Yeah. Leo won an Oscar this year for his first Oscar and I think it was pretty great and I think, I don't know, I think it's pretty cool. I, I got to make videos with a lot of my friends, that's always a plus. Well, really loved Hamilton, that's a really big thing on here that um, that play really like made it for a lot of younger people but also a lot of older people. Also Pokemon Go, I have to talk about that, that was a great thing, I really loved that for a while. I think it kind of died. It's it's kind of slowly on its decline. Cubs won the World Series. I'm a Cubs fan. Not super diehard, but I love the Cubs. Um, I just love Wrigley Field. I always loved going there when I was a kid um, or a teenager. The one excited thing I am, the one, thing, the one thing I'm most excited for is that Harriet Tubman is going to be on the $20 bill. I think this is so great. I think it's the my favorite thing that came out of 2016. And I know that's so small, but a black African woman who changed slavery. She changed it with the Underground Railroad. She was so iconic and so, so real. Well, I know we can talk about 2016 um, as the worst year. Uh, I know I didn't talk about the election, Donald Trump won, um, and people routing in the streets and like hating that. I could talk about Black Lives Matter and all the cop killings, 
But I feel like the media and just everything has totally drained that. And I don't feel like touching on it again. So I guess my final thing is that even though 2016 wasn't the best year, I feel that 2017, even though 2016 wasn't a good year, uh, 2015 people said wasn't a good year, 2014 wasn't a bad good year either. I mean, we always do this and we always like look at the bad stuff. And I know it's really easy to do that, but I feel we should also look at the good because there's a lot of good that happened this year in the crap ton that did. So guys, thank you for watching. I know I haven't uploaded in a while, but I wanted to just talk about what my favorite and worst things was about 2015 or 2016. I don't even know. Have a great New Year's. Love you guys. I'll talk to you in the next one. See you later. Love you. Boop.